Nasty! Soul Rag! Lola! Cherry Bomb! Here we are. Championship Racing is up front. We have Nasty on the inside. Soul Ride on the out. In the back row, we have Lola on the inside. Cherry Bomb on the out. We are Championship Racing. Is It's going to be Soul Ride out to a bit of a lead there. And he's being challenged by Nasty. And Soul Ride's got it going on as we go down here into that Drifter Street. And that's why it's called Drifter Street. Look at that Drifter. But that's Soul Ride. As we come down here to that final stretch, it's going to be one heck of a battle. Oh, look at Nasty trying to make a move. It's going to be Soul, Nasty, Lola, Cherry Bomb. And one heck of a first race. This is how you start off a championship event. Look at Soul Ride here. He's going back and forth with Nasty. Nasty's really trying to find any spot he can to get it past him, and he just don't have enough real estate to do it. Great first race. This Cherry Bomb better get it going. He need to be faster than that against these top-level competitors. This time we got Soul Ride on the inside, Lola on the out up front. In the back row we got Cherry Bomb on the inside, Nasty on the out. We are racing. And it's Soul Ride out to a lead again as he comes down here. Oh, you got Cherry Bomb putting in a block there on Mr. Nasty. Or is it Mrs. Nasty? I think it's Mrs. Nasty. Anyway, we come down here and it's going to be Soul Ride. He's got a big lead coming down here into that final stretch as the other three are battling it out for second, third, and fourth places. It is going to be Soul Ride. Here they come, followed up by Lola, Cherry, and then Nasty. Up front this time, we got Lola on the inside, Cherry Bomb on the out. In the back row, we've got Nasty on the inside, Soul Ride on the out. We are racing. And Cherry Bomb gets a little sloppy coming down that first set of straights or down into that open area. And that allows Lola to take a big lead. But here comes Cherry Bomb making a big charge. Can't she do it as we come down here into that final set of turns? Looks like all four cars are still going to be in it. Down that final stretch we go. I don't think she can. Nope. It's going to be Lola, Cherry, Nasty, and Soul Ride. Okay, let's head back up to the top. This is it to see who moves on to the bonus rounds of this championship race. It looks like it's going to be Soul Rider and Lola, but anything could happen here at the Comet Tail Raceway. Let's get this race going. We are racing. It's a nice group coming down that first straightaway. You got Soul Rider trying to make a move up there. And look at Cherry Bomb is holding everybody off. Cherry Bomb and Nasty are battling it out as Cherry Bomb does a little slide down there, a little drifting down there and Drifter straight. As they come down here into that final straight, it's going to be Cherry Bomb, Nasty, Soul Ride, and then Lola. Would you expect anything less here at the Comatel Raceway, folks? As you've got Soul Ride be moving on here to the championship round. But check this out. you got Cherry Bomb and Lola tied for second. They're going to have to do a best two out of three race off to see who will be joining Soul Ride in that championship round. Let's get on to it. The winner of this best two out of three matchup moves on to the championship round. Is this going to be Cherry on the inside, Lola on the out? Best of luck to both. We are racing. It's Cherry Bomb out to a bit of a lead coming down that first stretch. This is going to be a tight race like in this field. No, maybe not. Cherry Bomb's pulling further and further out. Can he hold it? Oh, but he gets that in, drifter straight, and starts to drift, and that opens up the door there for Lola, and it's going to be Cherry Bomb holding off Lola, taking a one to nothing lead. Cherry Bomb up one to nothing as we move on to round two. We are racing. Lola out to a bit of a lead down that first stretch, and Lola puts in a block. That really slows down both cars, and Cherry Bomb goes to a crawl right there. Smart move there by Lola. Lola's going to be going solo down here. Oh, here comes Cherry Bomb. Got a burst of speed. Trying to come through here. It's going to be Lola taking this one easily. Tying it up one apiece. All tied up. One apiece. Winner moves on to the championship round. We are racing. It's Cherry Bomb out to a bit of a lead. This time it's Cherry Bomb putting in the block and ramming Lola up against the wall there. And that's going to pay off big time for her. And a bit of a shocker here, folks. It looks like, oh, Cherry Bomb starts sliding around here again. And Cherry Bomb's got a big lead, but can she hold on to it? Come down here to that final stretch. Lola with an overtake and moves on to the championship round. Folks, this is what championship racing is all about. As we're going to slow it down and take one more look at this. Good drive by both people. Smart move right there. A little bump there by Cherry Bomb to really slow down Lola's momentum coming down that first straight. 
Look at this. Now you got tree bomb way off right now. Watch. She hits that drifter straight. That's why it's called drifter straight because they do a lot of drifting. But that really slows down her momentum. Sometimes that drifting is not a good thing to do. So come down here to the finish. Now watch this. Cherry's got a nice lead and then to the inside or to the outside goes Lola and overtakes Cherry Bomb to move on to that championship round. Great bit of driving by both. Molly. Sidekick Sandy. Rims. Romeo. Up front on the inside, we got Molly. On the outside, we got Sidekick Sandy. In the back row, we got Rims on the inside. Romeo on the out. We are racing. And that Sidekick Sandy is just a little bit of a lead. She's pushing over there on that side. That's going to slow up the other three behind her as we come down here into Armageddon Corner down to that Drifter Street. Sidekick Sandy gets a little drifting going on, but she seems to correct it nicely. Oh, you got Rims that flipped over on his lead. Sidekick gets a little loose. It comes down here. It is going to be Sidekick Molly Romeo with the DNF by Rims. Up front, we'll have Sandy on the inside. Rims on the out. In the back, we'll have Romeo on the inside. Molly on the out. We are racing. Nice tight group coming down that first set of straights into that first set of turns. We go, uh-oh, it looks like Romeo gets held up there on that killer straight. Can he get it survived and come back around? We do not know. We'll see as we come down to that final straight. They are all four still in it. It's a nice race. Oh, Sandy gets loose again, but it is going to be Sandy, Rims, Molly, Romeo. So far, it looks like Sandy's the car to beat in this heat. Let's do lap number three. We are racing it's a tight group coming down that first set of straights down into that first set of turns it's always not a good idea when they're that tight up there and sure enough we're going to lose molly on that killer straight as we come down here to that final set of straights they get a little bit of separation but they can change it's going to be romeo ram sandy dnf by molly when you got four tight cars battling it out up there something's got to give and last time it was molly that gave way as we head back up to the top we'll see what happens this time we are racing. It's a neck and neck race there between Molly and Romeo as they come down to that first set of turns. And this time it's Sidekick that gets pushed off. And Romeo seems to correct it himself as he got a little loose up there on that killer straight. We got all kinds of stuff going on back there as we come down to that final straight. We lost Sandy. Is it's going to be Molly, Rims, Romeo, and a DNF by Sandy. Are you kidding me? Sandy's going to be moving on to the championship round. And we're going to have ourselves another race off. This is the first time this has ever happened. Two heats, two race offs. This is what championship racing is all about. Here we go again. Molly on the inside, Romeo on the out. Good luck. We are racing. It's Molly out of that gate fast. And we come down here. It's still a nice tight race. So you got Molly pulling further and further out here as they come down here in the Armageddon corner oh she starts to drift that could cost her that's cost a lot of people and it is gonna be Romeo pulling up some gas oh wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute what a block put in by Molly to secure the win I noticed that we had a small glitch in her timer last race hopefully we got that fixed as Molly is up one to nothing we are racing it's a neck and neck battle i do mean neck and neck going into that first set of turns and oh look at that little burst of speed right there on that killer stray by molly and here comes molly well molly started to slide that would not have been good as romeo was right on his tail we come down here to the final and it is going to be molly moving on to the championship round here we go folks out of these four cars who will be season twos we are racing champion is up front we'll have sandy on the inside molly on the out in the back row, we have Lola on the inside, Soul Ride on the out. Good luck to all. We are championship racing. Is this Sandy out to a bit of a lead? No, they're bunching up right here before that first set of turns. And there you got it. Soul Ride flipped over on his lid. Is that what happens? Like we said, when you bunch up there on that first set of turns, oh, there goes Sandy sliding around like a coaster. Nope, she's got it back under control as we come down here to the final. It is going to be Sandy, Molly, Lola in a great first match of this championship round. It's Sidekick Sandy with the early advantage as she takes this first round of this championship heat. We are racing. Look at that neck and neck battle going on between Molly and Lola. As we come down here to that killer straight, it is going to be Molly taking the lead right there. Coming down here in the drifters. And there they start drifting. we got synchronized drifting going on again. And look at that charge coming on here by Sandy as we come down here to the end. This is going to be a really close tight race, folks, as it's going to end up being Molly, Lola, Sandy, and Soul Ride. 
It is Soul Ride who sets up front on the out. He needs this race to worse. He needs a first place finish here to give himself any chance at winning that championship. We are racing. Oh, and we got Soul Ride. His little rough start coming out of that gate, but he's still in good position here. He can still turn, come back and take this. But you got Lola that's pulling further and further out here as we come down here into that final straight. We got a good battle going on back there for a second. Here we go. It's going to be a good race. It's going to be Lola, Soul Ride, Sandy, and then Molly. Listen to that crowd. I can barely hear myself think as this is such a close race. This is it. It all comes down to this, folks. As you've got Lola with the advantage with 10, but then you got Molly and Sandy sitting right there at 9. If one of these three cars takes first place, they are going to be our season 2. We are racing champion. We are racing. And it's Soul Ride just edging out Sandy right there. And there's Sandy taking the lead. No, no, it's got Soul Ride coming back here. As we got a battle going on, all three of these cars back there in the second, third, and fourth place need this. As we come down here to that final street, this is going to be one heck of a race, folks. And we're going to look at it's going to be Soul Ride, Sandy, Molly, and then Lola. Congratulations to our season two. We are racing champion. My sidekick, sidekick, Sandy. Congratulations to her. Holy cow, I cannot believe she did this in her first season. I've tried nine seasons and have not been able to do this. She is our champion. Whoa. Wow, I'm going to need a drink after that race. Well, after that performance, Sidekick Sandy, you and all the rest of the drivers deserve a good cold one. As you barely edged out, both Molly and Lola had 11 points, and Soul Ride, after a terrible start, ended up with 9 points. The bad news is, folks, for the first season ever, we're not going to be giving away a car. As Sidekick Sandy's car was not picked by anybody, but that's okay. Guess what? Make sure you join us next season, as this is going to be even more exciting, as we're going to be giving away two cars, double the prize. That's right. Well, let's go up to the top and watch Sandy do her final victory lap. And here, what in the, what is Nasty do? Wait. Nasty's on the track, following Sidekick Sandy, but followed by, by not one, but two bullies? What in the world is going on here? I am confused. I, what, what, I, I just... Two bullies? 